Well, good morning, everybody. Happy Chinese New Year. Layla and I wanted to wish everybody a happy Chinese New Year, a happy Lunar New Year. Say hi, Layla. Layla. First off, my name is Jeff Street. I teach people how to make money from home online, but today uh, we just wanted to come to you and uh, you know wish you a year of uh, prosperity. And you know, Layla is uh, dressed up as the, the the lion today, which symbolizes you know good luck as we start this uh, Chinese New Year, which is the most important uh, holiday uh, in the Chinese uh, culture. And it with uh, three more than three thousand years. Of, uh, of tradition. Uh, we are out now with the year of the rat and we're in uh, with the year of the ox. And the Chinese zodiac for 2021, again, it's, it's the ox, which signifies great strength. Uh, it signifies for using the energy to create harmony between people and their environment. The ox is a sign of movement. The ox symbolizes uh, diligence, persistence, and honesty, those are incredible traits, you know, that every single one of us uh, needs to make sure that we go and have diligence, persistence, and honesty. And that, you know, the, the, um, the legend says that 3,000, you know, years ago that the Emperor Jade, you know, had the uh, animals of the Zodiac sign compete in a race to figure out which sign was going to go first. And the ox uh, came in second of the race. The, the, the legend says that the rat jumped onto the ox and then jumped off to actually cross the finish line, you know, first. But, you know, the, the, the year of the ox, you know, we, uh, you know, pray uh, this year for your family to have prosperity, to have new beginnings. The Chinese New Year's, uh, it celebrates a fresh start. It's a time to be with loved ones. It's a time to really hope for good things to, you know, to come. And, you know, I think for so many people, uh, this year certainly is a year uh, to go out and really have a fresh uh, start. And the most important, it's the most important and popular holiday in the Chinese, uh, you know, culture. So for our family, uh, we're celebrating today in my wife's culture and the Cantonese uh, culture. They like to shout out on Chinese New, New Year, what ah. And what that stands for is for prosperity. It's 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 a cheer for prosperity. And you know, here as we start this Chinese New Year, which is a two-year celebrate, or, sorry, a, a two-week celebration uh, again for uh, you know for the Lunar New Year, which is you know which is actually comes after. It's the second new moon after the winter uh, solstice, solstice. And in the Cantonese culture, you know, a way to go out and wish everybody a happy Chinese New Year is Gung He Fat Choi. Uh, so you can say to somebody, Gung He Fat Choi today, and that's wishing somebody a happy Chinese New Year. And it's a greeting that stands for greetings become rich. So Gung He Fat Choi, everybody. And again, we've got Layla here. We've got our little lion here today wishing everybody a happy Chinese New Year. So I hope everybody has a happy, safe, and prosperous New Year as we go out and have new beginnings, as we go out and celebrate with family, and as we come together and hope uh, for prosperity uh, for each and every one of us. So happy Chinese New Year, everybody. And we look forward to seeing everybody tomorrow. Have a, you know, and I, we hope for many red envelopes. Uh, for you today, but not just for you today, but we hope for this to be a, a year of prosperity, a year of new beginnings, a near, year of blessings uh, for you and for your family. So God bless everybody, and we'll see you tomorrow. Have a great day.